So I'm doing the intro today because somebody's a little bit hungover. Yeah, I'm a little bit hungover, but there's no such thing as a sick day at Beer Meets Food PLC. There's work to be done, so let's hit the road, Mrs. Beard. Mush! Just quietly. <laughs> McDonald's coffee. Nobody knows what's in this stuff. It's like liquid smack. I'm starting to warm up a little bit now. <laughs> this must be the green. That must be the hair. The hair on the green. But where do we park? Uh, I don't know. Fancy. Oh, it's a car park. What I expected to be a car park. <laughs> <laughs> no entry for you. Look at this car. This car is a mess. This is like Stig of the Dumps car. I'm, uh, I'm back in character now. I've got the, the hat on backwards. We mean business. I'm cosplaying as a, an extra from Monsters Inc. today. Look at this fluffy hoodie. Oh, it's lovely and warm. I hope this isn't too hard today. <laughs> This is the challenge, there's the uh, double challenge, which is more like a speed thing. A few people have done that. This is the triple, which 50 people have attempted, or I'm going to be the 50th person, and uh, only three people have managed to successfully do that. And you get it free if you finish, right? Free of a t-shirt. Ooh, and a t-shirt. I love a t-shirt. So you've got a double burger, which is 10 ounce brisket patties. Right. Then you've got a chicken burger, which is a whole 10 ounce breast. Right. And then you've got one more burger of your choice. You can pick another brisket burger, another chicken burger, or more. Oh, I like that when you get like a little bit of a bit of variety, a bit of choice. I think I'll probably go with the halloumi. Fantastic. To make it a full. And then it's two full set. of chips on a pizza plate. Cool. All right. Look at this. This is like a the throne. That is the throne. I might sit. You've got to sit. Look at this. <laughs> Well, I got the, a throne fit for a king, right? <laughs> I want number one in Europe for nothing. <laughs> Alright, so they're at a place called Hair on the Green, which is it's near Peterborough, but it's... Brampton. You literally just told me this like 20 seconds ago and I've already forgotten. Brampton, and um, I'm taking on their uh, triple in 30, um, and only three people have been successful. The, the person with the quickest time, also called Adam, um, he did it in 24 minutes and three seconds. We did 18 minutes. 18 minutes? Mm. What, what are you say, Mrs. Beard? 23. 23? All right, well, without further ado, this is Bimit's Food, and this is Hair on the Green's Triple in 30 Challenge. Three, two, one, go. All right, I'm gonna go with, I'll start with the chicken burger, I reckon. I'm gonna start my Yorkshire puddings. Oh, it's What's up, Barry? Welcome back to another episode. Oh, it looks hot as well. Looks <laughs> well, good, but it looks hot. <laughs> I'm gonna delay starting for like 20 minutes. Yeah, first time for everything. New year, new me and all that. Normally I just stick it down my god, piping hot. Ooh. Hot. Mm -hmm. hot. Yeah, hot but manageable. And delicious, did I mention that? It tasted really good. This is the chicken burger and it had fennel in for God's sake. That's a, that's a dead giveaway for a posh burger if you ask me. Now the biggest of all the burgers is this one. Look at this. And you don't get a choice on that one, do you? That looks like a mean burger, don't you think? It looks intimidating. Is that the two beef briskets with bacon or? Something like that. Oh. I don't know. Some kind of beef. It tasted good, though. The real problem with this was the size of it. It's not the size of my head. So, uh, yeah, this, this took some eating. This one, this is a large burger, man. Most people take that one apart. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm eating this like a burger purist. So help me God, we're eating this like a sandwich for a change. I don't know if it's because I was drinking mulled wine till like three o'clock in the morning, but this is going down really easily. <laughs> Welcome to Beard's Confessional. Yes, that's right. I plead guilty, I was out last night. Had a few drinks, mulled wine specifically. I'm a big fan of mulled wine in the winter time. And I think I might have discovered it. It's kind of like a competitive eating PED because um, it didn't half help the, uh, the, the food go down easy. I mean, the food was good, so that helped too, but um, yeah, I'm what's scientifically known as a lightweight in that I get incredibly drunk 
after only a few drinks. Probably because I don't drink much anymore. I used to when I was younger, but not these days. So I was feeling a little ropey this morning. But uh, we're getting it done. Slow but look at that. That's what you call getting it done. I tried to eat like a burger for as long as I could. There wasn't sufficient bun, I don't think. Yeah, I did my best, but some of the uh, the meat did inevitably escape the bun. Still, I really enjoyed this one. Um, I did, this is pretty much the hardest part of the challenge, you'd have to say. Oh, I've been going, Mrs. Beard. Uh, you have been going six minutes, three seconds. Oh. So chocolate, chop, chop. Better get a move on. This is a halloumi burger. No. It's too cheesy. <laughs> <laughs> this one is significantly smaller than the, the last one. For the record, I did say I didn't want to hear the joke. She just went ahead and told it anyway. <laughs> but we're on the halloumi burger now, which is one that you get to choose. You have to do the 20 ounce double beef burger. You have to do uh, a fried chicken burger. And the third one is one of your choice. <laughs> How do I look? Yeah. It's actually eight minutes. Just the chips now. <sighs> Can I steal your coke? No, <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, please, sir. Thank you. Thank you. I won't be giving it my. Yeah, she tries to make me fail now, you know, like at the, at the beginning she was really supportive, now she just wants me to fail every time. <laughs> Shut up, honey. <laughs> That's supportive. You wouldn't have liked it anyway, it's full fat coke. Your body is a temple. <laughs> <laughs> That's when you <laughs> Accurate assessment for about 167 hours of the week. Not today, though, and uh, I hate that term, full fat coke. There is no fine coke. It's full sugar coke. I might steal a little bit of your gravy. Yeah. Mix things up a little bit. Can I have a uh, fork? Are you going to hold that for me as well? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's last you'll be okay. It's the gravy nice. The gravy is nice. What kind of gravy isn't nice? Apart from your gravy. <laughs> Yeah, Mrs. Bird likes to think she's a bit of a gravy aficionado. So uh, nothing offends her more than pointing out her gravy recipe has two moves. Take it out the foil and bring it to the boil. <laughs> Have I got plenty of time because I've just totally lost track of it? No, you're doing too much yapping. Yeah, 13 and a half minutes in. You've got plenty of time. All right, we got a good 10 minutes to go, more even. I'm surprised genuinely that only three people have done this. Yeah, you never know. <laughs> oh, he's got a t-shirt out already. I was going to do like a dramatic, oh, I don't know if I'll make it. Yeah, this ain't Mountain food. I think we could do without the histrionics. Thank you very much. I don't think it's any secret at this point that I'm about to finish. But yeah, this is a good one. I really enjoyed it. it tastes good. Good prize package, free meal, free t-shirt. So I'd highly recommend it if you're in the area. I hope you enjoyed the video. And as always, I'll catch you in the next one. I'm getting all the little bits, don't worry. Oh. There we go. Sixteen. Oh. Well that was delicious, man. This is very, very nice. Especially the big one. You like a big one, don't you? Yeah. Do you have a dessert menu? I do. Do you have a dessert menu? <laughs> how, how you that? Anything else? You know what I'm gonna get because I've never seen this on sale anywhere in England. Pumpkin pie. Do you have the pumpkin pie? I'll, I'll get some pumpkin pie, please. Oh, thank you. You know what? I'm gonna show this to camera because people keep getting mad that I, that I don't show the t-shirt every time. Nice. It's crisp. It's um, stylish. Minimalist, I'd say, but it's a uh, it's a good one.
Mrs. Biz, that she's not ordering from the menu, but she's ordering like some custom, what was it? Yorkshire puddings and mash, is that what she asked you for? And gravy, it makes sense, yeah. That's my perfect. <laughs>